What's up, world? Welcome back to uh, Clark Crew Reviews. Your boy just got back from uh, checking out Avengers Infinity War. It was a little bit of a journey for us today. Drove to the theater with the reclining seats. Like I told you I was in my little pregame video. I knew there was a chance it might be sold out, but they have like four showings back to back. So I thought I'd roll the dice. They were all sold out. I couldn't make it at the reclining theater. So I had to drive back and go to our local theater and watch it. I got in at the second showing. Mm. It was worth it. It was worth it. Avengers Infinity War was very good. It was very good. This is this is my spoiler free review. I will give you my spoiler review. I'm gonna shoot for Monday to give y'all the weekend. But it was very good. The Russo brothers were not lying when they said that in the first 10 minutes you would see how powerful Thanos really is. That first 10 minutes, he put in work. He put in work. Like Rihanna. Work, 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 work. Like, he put in work, bro. Throughout the movie, he was an unstoppable force. He was, that's a bad boy. That's a bad boy. He may be Marvel's best villain. Killmonger has a special place in everybody's heart. But Josh Brolin Thanos, he was on a mission he was not going to be stopped everybody got a piece of him everybody got a piece of Thanos in this movie before I venture off and call him one of the best comic book villains ever I want to see this Avengers part 4 I got to see it I got to see the conclusion before I say that, but this first movie, he is making a claim for that top spot. I ain't gonna lie to you, he's making a claim for it. You'll see why when you see the movie. It's pretty much a Thanos movie. He has the absolute most screen time out of anybody. Thor, I got new respect for Thor. Like, the Thor in this movie is completely contrast from Ragnarok. Like, this is the mentality in this Thor. It's the same Thor as Thor 1 and 2, like noble, stern, you know, stoic character. And he, hey, Thor kicks ass in this, for real. Iron Man kicks a little ass. And that third act in Wakanda, everybody getting a piece of that action. That Black Order's pretty tough, too. Them MFers was tearing stuff up. They ain't no joke. It is about two and a half hours long. It's worth it. There was a point in the movie to where they jump around and for a split second, it reminded me of Justice League. Now, Justice League is a completely different movie, but the way they're going from scene to scene, different locations, reminded me of Justice League for a little bit. But, I was telling my dad that with a big ensemble cast like that, 
to piece everything together in the climax of the movie, you almost have to have it that way. And I didn't feel like it was too scattered and I don't feel like it was cluttered at all. I don't feel like it was cluttered. I think it came together nicely. Now, granted, some people are gonna get more screen time than others. Some people are gonna get more shine, but I feel like everybody added something to it. I feel like everybody added something to it. There was a lot of action in it. There was hella action in this movie. Like, if you like action, and I, you know, like, I mean, I like action, and seeing the characters feed off of each other on the same screen, it was dope. It was almost cussed, but it was dope. It was dope, man. It was good. It was good. I ain't gonna tell you what ranks in my favorite comic book movies. I ain't gonna do that. Not yet. I'll wait. But it's good. It's worth the price of admission. It is worth the price of admission. Thanos is a mother in this mother, boy. He, he's, the, he's the right type of villain. Strong and powerful. Sentimental. He believes his cause is righteous. And he destroys anything that gets in his way. There are some new powers in this for each of the characters. Well, not each, but the main characters, you know, had some new abilities. But uh, it was dope, man. It was pretty dope. If you like spoilers and... Oh, like moments of shock this is the perfect movie for you because there's a few times when I was like no no but it was good man I thoroughly enjoyed it I give it a solid A I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10 I mean it wasn't perfect it wasn't perfect 9 out of 10 I give that bad boy a solid A The worst part is you gotta wait a whole year to see Avengers Infinity 4. Not Infinity 4, Avengers Part 4. Damn, that's a long way away. It leaves you wanting that Part 4. Like, next week. Like Netflix, binge watch that mug. It was good though, y'all. It was good, it was really good. Go check it out. Go check that MF out. Went, got my nice little souvenir cup. That mother's pretty straight, right? Paid a little extra for it. Got the Infinity Gauntlet right there. I need me an Infinity Gauntlet for real. Infinity Gauntlet. Good old Sprite Lemonade mixed. It was a good movie, y'all. Go check it out. I give you my spoiler reaction early in the week. If you liked my review video for Avengers Infinity War, please like this video. Please share this video. And please subscribe to our channel. A couple of my crewmates went with me to see it, but it's a school night. One's a little tired. She's in bed. The other one's going to bed, too. I'm fitting to go to bed because it was a journey today to see this movie, but it was worth it. And it's late, and your boy got to get up in the morning. All right? We get a notification that you subscribe to us. We'll subscribe back. Until next time, y'all be good. Peace.